In front of me is OnePlus Nord and let me show you some of the secret codes that you can use on this device. So first of all you have to open your phone dialer and go to keypad because this is the place where we'll be entering those codes. So let's start with the first one which is asterisk pound, triple eight and pound at the end. And as you can see here we've got the hardware PCB version and the QR code to check it. So smoothly scan it via another device and then you'll be provided with all details regarding your hardware version. So let's go back. Now we will check the software version. To do it, the code is pretty easy because it is asterisk pound, one, two, three, four, and pound at the end. And here it is, as you can see, software version is right in front of you. Tap on OK to go back. And now we'll open unique numbers assigned to your device, like for example, email number, and the code for it is asterisk pound, oh, six pound. And here it is, as you can see, you've got both email numbers and also serial number assigned to your OnePlus Nord. To go back, you have to click on OK. And another code that we would, we would like to use is asterisk pound, six, six pound. And here you can check and encrypt email number. So as you can see here, you've got number, encrypt MA, and also QR code to scan if you'd like to check some further details. So this is it. Let's go back to the keypad and another code that you can use. It's actually performed by Google. It is asterisk pound, asterisk pound, four six, three six, pound asterisk, pound asterisk. And here we've got the testing mode where you can read phone info, user statistics, and also Wi-Fi details. So if you will click on phone information, you can smoothly check it right here. So you can check phone number, current network, signal strength, voice service, data service, data network type, and so on. If you will scroll down a bit lower here, you've got ping test, so smoothly run ping test to, to do it. Just click on this tab. And as you can see here, it passed. So let me go back. Then under user statistics, you will be able to check detailed information about your apps. So for example, if you want to check usage time or maybe last time used, here you've got all details. So as you can see, all apps are included. And for example, we played Fortnite for almost one hour. And let me go back. And the last option here is Wi-Fi information, where you can check Wi-Fi APA, Wi-Fi configuration, and also Wi-Fi status. Under Wi-Fi APA, you will find disabled network, disconnected networks, enabled networks, configured networks, and the whole general connection info. Then under Wi-Fi configuration, you will find all configured networks, and a bit lower in Wi-Fi status, just refresh it. You can check the current status of your network. Also, this mode allows you to run a ping test. Just click here, and here it is. So that would be all for this code. We can go back. And now we will open the calendar storage. To open it, you have to enter asterisk pound, asterisk pound, double to five, pound asterisk, pound asterisk. And here it is. As you can see here, you've got all information stored in your calendar. So holidays and country you are staying in, your own events, and from now on you will not forget about any important celebration, anniversary, or so on. So let me go back. And the last code that I would like to share with you is diagnostic mode. So just enter asterisk pound, asterisk pound, four to six, pound asterisk, pound asterisk. And as you can see here, we've got events, also status. And if you'd like to apply advanced view, just tap on more icon, click on advanced view, and then you can check some further details and information. So that would be all. These are all codes that I wanted to show you today. Enjoy and use them as only you want to and whenever you need to. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe our channel and leave the thumbs up.